a bow to Thailand's king and queen on arrival at Bangkok airport. Ousted in a coup 17 years ago, the billionaire former Prime Minister Thaksin Shinawat is back on home soil. He has spent the last 15 years in self-imposed exile. Adored by millions and reviled by millions, it is a historic homecoming, one that sees him spending a first night in jail. Just as his political party pursues power with military rivals who toppled him. He's basically uh, trying to make a deal, forming a government with pro-military parties, cut a deal to, uh, to fast-track his return with minimum uh, jail sentence. But th the trick is that, you know, Thaksin is, being, is, ask, is asking to be treated as an exception. The 74-year-old has been a giant of Thai politics for more than two decades. That past has included mass protests by his supporters, the Red Shirts, who formed following the coup in 2006 that deposed him. Courts have intervened to remove pro in governments since then and dissolve parties loyal to him. A coup in 2014 ousted his sister Yingluk as Prime Minister. Thaksin has thrown his weight behind his daughter Pei Tong Tan, who is a key figure in the Shinawatra family's Perth Thai party. Thaksin is uh, well known for uh, brinkmanship, for drama. You know, he is not a person who goes by due process. He is known to be a player with, uh, you know, going through a fast track, uh, shortcuts, and uh, seemingly always with an, an ace up his sleeve. The first step for him now he is home has been his arrest and detention after being convicted in his absence in several criminal cases to eight years in jail. There is speculation he has cut a deal for leniency.